Hi, in this lecture, I'm going to start poly painting the head and I'm going to put the base color first. So here you can see our model has a matte cap gray material. So I'm going to first change this material to skin material. So let's go to this material, click on that and select skin set 4 here. So this is the skin material and as soon as you chose that, it looks bright here. So that's fine. So now I'm going to pick the colors, the base skin, which is the pale, no fair color. So I'm going to pick that color. So it's kind of yellow, orange, something like this. Once you choose this color, this no material. So I'm going to fill this material and this color to the entire object here. So for that, I'm going to choose this MRGB. M for material and RGB, RGB for color. So choose this one and turn off any G add or G sub. Make sure you are changing the you know, standard brush. So I don't want any G sub or G add while I'm painting or texturing. So just the MRGB or RGB. In this case, I'm choosing this because I want to paint the material. So now let's go to color here and fill object. Click on this option to actually fill that whole color and this material to this entire object. Now you can see once I fill that, if I change this material to any of these other materials, that body material is still like that skin material because I fill that material. Okay, now we like fill that base color with the skin material. So again, let me go back to the skin material. Okay, so now I'm going to color the leaf. So let's choose a pink color which is a little bit reddish here let's choose bit pink side so the brush make sure you don't have any g add or g sub uh, let's say you have g add or something you have forgotten to turn off that while you painting you might change the model as well as you can see i'm also changing the model so this is not good and i don't want this right now so make sure you don't have anything here so g add g sub is off and i'm just painting it now once i have like painted the skin material so i don't want that anymore so just rgb is fine so i'm going to now you can see i'm not changing any surface shape because i don't have any g add or g sub just the rgb and let's paint this leaf roughly okay i think this is fine so we just paint the base color to the body and this you no know, um, this lip and now i'm going to put a dark inside nose so let's let's first sample this body color by just dragging this color picker to the skin you can sample any color you can see wherever i uh, take that mouse cursor it samples that color so let's choose this body color now I'm going to just go to a darker value of that color and let's paint that. Now you can see I'm also working on you no know, working on the symmetry. That is fine. And you can also go ahead and you can put some little bit variation to the skin. Let's again sample the skin and let's say a little bit variation a little bit darker tone to the behind there and let's put some darker tone here okay a little bit we are going to uh, see how to bring different color zone to the face in the next lecture in this lecture we are just painting the base base color so i think this is fine so i'm stopping this lecture here in the next lecture we are going to see how to bring the life into the face you can see in real world we don't have a single skin tone our face has different skin tone and we are going to see that in the next lecture